This is a very exciting day out here because we're drilling a well and it's done very well. You see, we just put in this acre vegetable garden. I want to make sure we had plenty of water to make sure that we could water all the plants that we're putting in the acre. We're going to also do rainwater harvesting off the buildings, but just in case it really gets dry, I wanted a good backup. Well, you know, I couldn't believe it last uh, week when you gave me these rods and we walked the property and when we got near that spot, they just started going wild. Do you always witch wells every time you put one in? Uh, most of the time, not always. If it's in a good area, you don't need to really. Show me how you do that. Well, you hold them, lock your elbows to your side and you hold them about that far apart and hold them in a downward angle. If you get them up like this, they'll swing on their own. Right. You, you just hold them down them here slightly down. and just start walking easy. And when you come across the water, they'll start doing that right there. See, I'm, I, I'm not doing that. That's, that's doing it on its own. You know, that's what happened on this spot. And you and I went at it from several different directions and decided that was the place to go. 50 gallons a minute. How long have you been drilling wells? Not as long as you think, about 15 years. 15 years, yeah. Well, it's, uh, did you travel all over doing it? No, I probably stay in a 50, 75 mile radius. Yeah. I don't like to go any further than this. It takes me too long to get to work. <laughs> I understand. <laughs> well, the, the, what's interesting about this rig, it, 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 it's all self-contained, isn't it? You can just about go anywhere and drop it in and yeah. see what you can do, yeah. How often do you come up with nothing? Occasionally I do. Yeah. I just, last one I drilled, uh, over here, I only got three gallon a minute for a fellow, and we went 200 foot with it. Oh, heavens. Yeah. What, what's behind this, uh, this witching of well? What, what, how, how does that happen? Do you have any idea? Well, I guess it's just a magnetic force from that water. I don't know. Yeah, it's a but mystery. You, but you can find a, a water line in the ground that's buried with that, or a septic tank, yeah. or whatever. Now, uh, before they used metal rods, didn't they use green saplings? Yeah, a lot of people still do. Yeah, and the green saplings will move the yeah. same way. Is there a particular kind of tree that's better than another? They like a gum or well, a peach tree or something like that. Something's yeah. got a lot of water in it, yeah. I guess. Yeah, yeah interesting. Well, I, I, I just can't tell you how pleased I am to get this kind of water up here. Thanks so much. Yeah, you're welcome. I'll share some of these vegetables with All you. All right, I'm ready for that. <laughs>